Hello my dear students and viewers welcome to my channel Scorpio class If you are looking for class 10 social studies notes of revised syllabus then you are on the right platform and watching the right video as in this video we are going to discuss class 10 geography chapter India transport and communications question and answers this video is going to provide you all the question answers of this chapter and it's going to be very helpful and informative for you all. So stay tuned till end and do not skip any part of it. And my dear viewers, if you also want all the other lessons notes of class 10 social studies as well as of English subject, you can visit the description box and find the playlist link where you will find the videos of all the notes. And the link will also be shared in the i button above. Now let's move ahead but before that if you are new to my channel and watching my video for the first time do subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get the notifications of all the upcoming videos. Let's get started with the first main we have fill in the blank the first one. The name of the international airport of Bangalore is Dash and it is Kempe Gauda International Airport. Next. Dash is necessary for the development of villages and agriculture. Answer is road transport. Next, Dash port is called Gateway of India. Answer is Mumbai. Next, the national highway between Mumbai and Bangalore is named as Dash. Answer is National Highway 4. So with this we have finished up and in the blanks. Now let's move to the next main that is answer the following questions. And the first question is what are the advantages of transport? Answer. The advantages of transport are transport provides goods and services from the place of production to the place of demand. Through the transportation goods and services reach to the places of requirement. The role of transport in the economic development of our country is significant. Areas of agriculture, industries, mining, forestry, fisheries, dairy farming etc. are closely linked with the markets through the transports. So these are the advantages of the transport. Let's move to the next question. What are the four types of major roads? Answer. The four types of major roads are national highways, state highways, district roads and village roads. So these are the four types of major roads. Next question. What do you mean by transport? Answer. Movement of goods, services, information and materials from one place to another is called transport. Next question. Which is the longest national highway? Answer. NHT Varanasi to Kanyakumari is the longest national highway. Next question. Make a list of major ports in India. So the major ports of India are Kandla, Mumbai, Marmagoa, New Mangalore Port, Kochi, Chutikon, Chennai, Vishakapatnam, Paradip, Kolkata and Haldia. So these are the list of the major ports of India. Next question. Which of the ports have links with national highways? Answer. Mumbai, that is Sahara and Santa Cruz. Delhi, Indira Gandhi International Airport. In Kolkata, Subhash Chandra Bose Airport. In Chennai, Anna or Minambakam, Bangalore, Kempe Gauda. Hyderabad, Ahmedabad, Panaji, Amritsar. Guwahati and Tiruvananthapuram. All national highways and corridors provide links to these ports. Let's move to the next one. What do you mean by communication media? Answer. Communication media refer to the ways, means 
or channels of transmitting message from sender to the receiver. Next one. What are the types of communication? Answer. Posts, newspaper and radio, television, satellites, computer network, internet, email, mobile telephones, etc. are the main types of communication. So nowadays we have many types of communications which are mentioned here. So let's move to the next one. Mention the importance of communication. Answer. The importance of communication are with the help of communication media, people of the country can learn about the various incidents of different places. The people can be aware of the policies of the government. By educating people through mass media about agriculture and industry, a speedy developmental process is possible. Mass communication media have become the fundamental requirement of trade and commerce. Mass media can be effectively utilized to strengthen the unity, integration and stability in the country. So these are the importance of communication. Let's move to the next one. What is GPS? Mention its uses. Answer. GPS means Global Positioning System. Its uses are, they are useful in assessing the geographical position of natural calamities so that suitable safety measures are taken. It is helpful for trackers to know the exact location and routes. Soldiers, pilots, fishermen and sailors use GPS to follow correct path and direction. Today, transport authorities also use this to manage the movement. GPS is the lifeline for many services at their door in the cities. GPS shows path to Google Maps. Okay, so these are some of the uses of GPS. Next one. Write about remote sensing technology answer it collects information regarding the earth surface it gathers information about distance without physically touching about the object aerial and satellite photos are taken from the remote sensing so this is some lines few lines about remote sensing technology with this, we come to an end with the lesson's notes and I hope these answers were helpful and informative for you all. If you liked the video and if you found it interesting and helpful, do hit the like button and share it with your friends. Do subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more such videos. Thank you.